Okay, so we have again another problem for um, masses and weights. So we'll try to solve this problem. So we have five masses in a region where the acceleration due to gravity is 30.5 feet per second squared are as follows. So M1 is 500 grams of mass, M2 weighs 800 gram force, M3 weighs 15 pondals, M4 weighs 3 pound force, and M5 is 0 0.10 slug of mass. So what is the total mass expressed in grams, in pounds, and in slugs? Okay, so we will try to have the solution of this one. So first we will write the given for so for our first mass M1. So that will be 5 grams of mass M2. So M2 is unknown. The given is the weight of M2 which is equal to 800 equal to 800 gram force we have here m3 also the given is just its weight so that is 15 pondals so we have weight of F m3 is equal to 15 pondals and we have m4 so the given is also its weight so we have uh, equal to 3 pound force and we have the last one M5 which is in slugs so that will be 0 0.1 slug okay so we need to find the masses the total mass of these uh, five um, masses so as we notice we have some given that are uh, that are in weight and at masses we need to convert find a way to convert this one to make this uh, given into mass okay so we will uh, solve that one convert that one okay, so we'll have another blank slide here so let's uh, have first for letter A so we need to have our um, units in grams okay so for M1 it is already given so this is equal to 500 gram mass so M2 so the given for M2 it's its weight which is equal to 800 gram force Okay, so we need to convert gram force into gram mass. So by using the formula, we have W2 is equal to M2 J over K. So if we are solving for M2, we could manipulate that one into uh, W2 times K over J. So we need first to establish our G. Sorry for the J, but that is G. So our G from the given is equal to 30.5 feet per second squared. So we need to convert this one into, and uh, that, that is gram, so that is in CGS. We need to convert that one into uh, centimeters per second squared. So we have 30.5 feet per second squared. Then convert first into inches. We have 12 inches per feet. Okay. So we could cancel now our feet. Then we have 2.54 uh, centimeter per inch. So we could cancel our inch. So we are left with um, centimeters per second squared. Okay. So we will use our calculator. So we have... 30.5 uh, times 12 times 2.54 so all over 1 I believe so that's all over 1 equals 929.64 so we have 
929.64 centimeters per second squared. So we could now solve for M2. Okay, so let's uh, do that. So we have weight is equal to 800 gram force. Okay, so for K, this is 980.66. Um, gram mass meter over gram force second squared then our K so our K is 929 uh, no, our J G 29.64 centimeters per second squared so I believe this is not meters and centimeters okay, so let's Correct that one. Okay, so let's go back to this is centimeter because we are in CGS. Okay, so we could cancel this one out, this one, this one, and this one. So we are left with the unit in grams. Okay, so we have. Um, our calculator so we try to use so that one using our calculator so we have 800 times 980.66 over 929.64 okay and this is now equal to 800 43.91 so we have we will just uh, we will just run this one to the uh, to two decimal places so we have 900 ah uh, no 800 sorry for that so 800 just check it first so 843.91 91 gram mass so we have now for m2 okay so let's highlight this one so that we will not forget so this is for our m2 this is for our m1 then we will add another blank slide okay so now we will go for our m3 so m3 so the given for M3 is the given unit is in Pondal. So this is so the weight is and uh, the mass is unknown. So our weight 3 is in 15 Pondals. Okay, so we will solve the um, we will solve uh, the mass of W3 in or the weight. Uh, the third, uh, the weight of the uh, third mass in gram mass. So we just try to convert that one. So we could say that the uh, mass three. This is equal to W three or weight of the third mass over G. So we we'll substitute. We will substitute that one. Okay, so we will have this one. So uh, we, su we substitute this one. So we have um, we have fifteen pondals pondals. So multiplied by our k so our k in this uh, instant is is uh, one pound mass uh, this will be feet is equal to pondals uh, second squared all over our uh, g which is 30.5 feet per second squared so we could cancel out our second squared our feet 
per pound dal. So we will be left with pound mass. Let's sum our calculator. Okay. So we have 15 bundles times 1. That's over 30.5. Quals, so we were left with, let's have the fraction, so 0 0.49. Okay, so 0 0.49. 0 0.49 pound mass if we are going to convert this one in grams so our conversion factor is that um, uh, 453.6 gram mass is equal to 1 pound mass so that is the conversion factor for that so cancel out the pound mass so we will have, so our answer is this one, so we will just multiply that with 453.6 and that is now equal to 223.08. So 223.08. So we have. 223.08 gram mass so this will be our m3 here so it's just underline this one so that we could not we not forget that forget that then we will go to m4 so m4 so the the given is three pound force so the given is weight so it's three pound force. So we will go back to our formula. So we have M4 is equal to W4 times K all over G. So our W4 is three pound force and multiplied by our K, which is equal to at 32.2 pound mass then feet all over pound force um, second squared okay this is 3 not 31 this is 3 pounds okay all over our uh, g which is equal to 32 point uh, 30 point 5 uh, feet per second squared so we will cancel this one out, cancel, 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 cancel. So we will end up with we'll end up with so I believe I believe this pound mass. Okay, so let's just solve this one. So we have th three times thirty-two point two all over 30.5 and this will be equal to 3.17 so 3.17 okay so let's just write that 3.17 3.17 pound mass then we will convert this one into uh, gram mass so we have 453.6 gram mass is to 1 pound mass. I believe in this one we forgot the error. Okay, so cancel, cancel. So we'll end up with this 317. So let's just calculate that one. 317 that is our answer times 453.6. And this is equal to 1436.65 okay so 
36.65 gram mass. Okay, so that is now our uh, M4 or our fourth mass in the unit in grams. So we will highlight this one so that we will not forget. Okay, now we go to another slide for our M5. Okay, for our M5. So we have M5 is equal to um, 0 0.1 slugs. So we need to convert our slug into um, gram mass. So we have so we have uh, 0 0.1 as uh, 0.1 slug is equal to 32.174 pound mass per one slug then we will so this will be in pound mass we'll just go directly convert this one into uh, grams so per pound mass so cancel cancel so we left with uh, gram mass okay so let's calculate this one so we have point 0.1 so times 32 I believe that it's not 32.174 but 32.2 so we just correct the one later so 453 453 453.6 okay. 0.6 is equal to 140 point 100 1460.59 so 1460.59 this is gram mass so we'll uh, correct this one because we are using 32.2 so this will be 32.2 okay so we have now this is now our bm5 so let's just underline this one so if we are going to get the total mass so summation of masses okay so we have m1 plus M2 plus M3 plus M4 plus M5. Okay, so our M1 is 500 gram force. Okay, of course, no gram mass. Sorry for that. Plus, so our M2, going back for M2, that is 843.91. So we have. 843.91 gram mass plus or M3 so that is 223.08 so 223.08 gram mass and for our M4 is 1436.65 plus 1436.65 gram mass plus our M5 which is 1460.59 gram mass so we'll uh, use our calculator to add is five masses okay so we have here 500 uh, 500 and 500 plus 843.91 plus 223.08 plus 
1436.65 plus 1460.59 we have the total mass we have the syntax error ah ok so I just press a fraction just have the one over one equal to 400 a uh, 4464.23 so our answer is equal to 4464 point I forgot the decimal 0.23 23 gram mass and this is our answer for the first requirement the letter A so 4464.23 gram mass okay so we will go now to letter B okay so our letter B the total mass must be in I believe that will be in pounds okay so pounds so our total mass from the previous from letter A so this is equal to 4464.43 4, uh, gram mass let me check first if 23 is that 23 okay 23 so sorry for that one this is 23 okay so this is 2 okay so we will convert this one into pound mass so one pound mass is equal to 453.6 gram mass so cancel cancel so we will have so this our calculator so let's put our calculator over here okay so we have will be 400 4, 4,464.23 and this will be divided by divided by 453.6 this is equal to 9.84 pound mass so we have 9.84 pound um, yes. and this will be our answer for letter B now for letter C so let's have that one in maybe this color so letter C so in unit now must be in slugs okay so the summation of masses so we will use the answer in letter uh, B which is in uh, pound mass because you can use it directly to convert into slugs 9.84 pound mass then we have um, we have uh, once uh, one slug okay let's just correct that one we have one slug is equal to 32.2 pound mass so we can cancel that one out so we will have this so calculator so this uh, problem with our calculator okay so this one we have 9.84 over 32.2 and the answer is 0 0.31 okay or 0 0.31 so 0 0.31 slug and this will be our so let's just have the color other color for letter C, 0 0.31 slug and there you have it, we have solved the problem. Okay, thank you all for watching this video and as always, keep on 
study.